Today we're going to make chickpea parsley salad. Before we begin, if we have long hair, we should tie it back. Put on your apron. And if you have any cuts or you just want to be extra sanitary, put on rubber gloves. For this recipe, we will need the following ingredients. One 15 ounce can of chickpeas or garbanzo beans, it's the same thing, drained and then rinsed, like so. One red onion, sliced into wedges that are pretty thin. A handful of chopped basil. If you don't like that, you can leaf it out. Ha ha ha. And you also need a fourth of a cucumber. And the cut for this on the recipe is very specific, but it's also very difficult. So it asks you to cut it like this piece. It asks you to half the fourth of a cucumber and then cut it diagonally. So it would end up looking like small wedges almost. This isn't very important because you're making a salad. So if you are afraid of doing this, or if your knife isn't very sharp, or if your cucumber's a little dry, that can make chopping a little bit harder too. You can just cut it into slices like this. That's fine too, it works just as well. You will also need about 100 grams, which is about four ounces of crumbled feta cheese, some extra salt and pepper, two tablespoons of red wine vinegar, about a fourth a cup of olive oil, and a small bunch of flat leaf parsley roughly chopped. This means that you don't have to get every leaf or cut it into small pieces. It's just to get it off the stems and kind of break it apart so you don't want things like that in there. To begin, mix your red wine vinegar and your extra virgin olive oil with some salt and pepper. You're also going to need a fork for this. Other supplies you will need for this recipe, you will definitely need a large bowl to put your salad in. And possibly a fork and a spoon to toss your salad with. Now we're going to add pepper. I like to add a lot of pepper. This is your salad dressing. You can add more olive oil if you like. There is no limit on olive oil in the recipe. I just like to use a fourth a cup. That's what works best for me when I've made this before. All right, so now we can begin with our next step. Mix all of your vegetables and peas into the bowl. And with regards to your small bunch of parsley, if you'd prefer to use a bigger bunch of parsley, go on ahead, no one's stopping you. It's all up to you how much you like parsley. Alrighty. Now I'm gonna go on ahead and toss this. All right, so this is 170 grams, so it's almost twice as much as I need, so I'm just gonna sprinkle on about half. I'm going ahead and add my dressing. 
You might want to give this a good mix before you add it, just again, because the red wine vinegar and the olive oil aren't going to actually incorporate into each other, so they'll separate again with time. And you can toss this again now that you've got your dressing in there. And there you go, easy as that. Greek chickpea parsley salad makes a great side dish or a great summertime snack.